Hello friends, welcome to the new session of Oracle SQL Developer Tips and Tricks for Beginners. In this session, we are going to see one important tips in Oracle SQL Developer, how we can import Excel sheet by using Oracle SQL Developer. Uh, import, we can uh, use Excel sheet by, in two ways. If you don't have a base table, you can uh, use the Excel sheet and import as a new, you can import and create a new table. Or else if you have a base table but it don't have data, you can import the Excel sheet by insert the data alone. First we will see data with table structure. So for creating table structure by table and data by using Excel sheet, you have to click on the table. First of all, you have to connect your schema and extract the connection and click on the table uh, tab and right click and import data. So when you click import data, you will get one big wizard and here you have to specify, uh, you have to select your Excel sheet. My, my case, I already have one uh, sample Excel sheet, course detail I am going to import, course ID, course name, these are all the columns, there are four columns are there in the Excel sheet, course ID, course name, course fees and course duration. So when I import uh, this Excel sheet, we will create a uh, table as well as the data. So I am going to import the data first, browse and I have saved in desktop. So you have to click on your Excel sheet and click open. So it will open uh, here forever. And here you have uh, next in the next step you have to specify the table name. So table name I am going to give you as course details. I need a table called course detail. So I am going to create it through this Excel sheet. So click next. And here if you don't want any column from the Excel sheet and you can click and you can skip it. I want all the columns so that I am going to include that also. So we have selected all the four, four columns. So if you want uh, any position change, you can track it and uh, place it anywhere you want. Click next. And uh, in this plan, in this place, you have to specify your uh, column data type. So course ID always number, course name, I want a worker. I am going to change my data type length and course fees number. So here I am going to specify as 10. Course duration, worker 2. So I am going to give us 60. So whether it's a nullable field or not null field, you can check it here. Whether it column have any default value you can mention it here so once you have done all these changes click next and click finish so if you have more data in your excel sheet it may take few minutes to complete myself i have only few data so our import has been successfully and the commit and, and also committed in the database so we can check here whether the table uh, get got selected or not Select star from course details. That's all our uh, table has been create, created. So this is very sim simple way we can uh, create our table and import data by using Oracle SQL developer. Next we will see if we have data, if we have table but we don't have data, how we can import uh, data alone from Excel sheet. First, uh, we will delete this data from this table. Delete from this table. So, all five rows deleted, committed here. Now, we will check the table. The table uh, don't have any data. So, in this case, we have an empty table, but we don't have any data on the table. We have to import it from Excel sheet. So, in this case, you have to extract your uh, table tab and check your table and click on it and right click and import data. The same import uh, wizard will open but here you, you don't want to specify the table name, it will take automatically. Browse the excel sheet you want, Check click the excel sheet and click open and next your table name uh, will select it by default and click next and check the column you want to import and the data types are uh, by default it will take and check and finish 
So now the data has been imported. We can check check in the table. So now the data are imported. You can check here. So here we have learned uh, two methods. So when you don't have table and uh, you want to import uh, data, you can use the first method. The second method, if you have empty table, you want to import the data alone, you can uh, prefer the second method. I hope uh, these two tips will helpful for many people. In the upcoming videos, I will upload more tips and tricks in Oracle SQL Developer. If you want uh, more videos like this, you can share with your friends. Thank you, friends.